Welcome back to the channel. In this one, I'm going to show you how to quickly reset your PIN number if you've locked out your device. So, on your Absolute, there's nothing published on how to reset this. And all you actually have to do is go into the ADB. So that's basically just booting it up in safe mode and then reflashing your device. There's no easy way to do it. Or this is the easiest way to do it, I should say. There's no other way that I've found to do it. So, okay, I'm in my device right now, but I'm going to turn it off. Imagine, if you will, that it's actually locked. So power it off completely. Now, I would suggest you charge it up till it's nearly full. This is only about 20% just now, but, and have a cable on it just in case. I have it powered the whole time. So that's shut down. Okay, so it's just charging up just now. So we're going to boot into the ADB, which is the Android debug bridge. So it's just basically a way to get into flash your device. So you want to press the power button, let go, and then press the plus button for volume. And what you should see is the device come to life, and you've got a little tiny menu. I'm actually just going to unplug this just now, because I'm not going to flash mine, but you need to see this. So it's difficult to see there, but you want to go to recovery. Okay. And to get to the recovery, you want to push the plus button on the side. And I'll help you scroll through the options. So you've got recovery, fast boot, and normal. So normal if you just want to boot it up. Personally, I would just press and hold the power button to shut it down again. So we're going to go to recovery. And then, so then you push the minus button and it will restart your device. And it should boot up into the ADB mode. Here we go. So we're in the, the recovery screen. So you've got reboot system now. Now you'll find it's none of your buttons work. It's the plus and minus still. So you've got reboot to bootloader, enter fast boot, apply an update from ADB, apply an update from SD card, wipe data or factory reset. That's the one you want to use. Just, just wipe the device back to start. Now this is great if you're selling your absolute, you pass it on to someone else. Um, you could wipe it via the OS, you know, once it's booted up. But if you've forgotten your PIN number or whatever, just go in here and reset it there. There's other options as well. You can do various tests and you can power off. Now, it's the up and down are plus and minus volume options. So I'll do the plus now, just so you can see that goes back up the menu. And the down button takes you down. And to pick an option, you just press the power button momentarily. So I'll just power this off. Now you can see it's powered down. And we can just boot this back up as normal. So I'm not going to reset this one because I'm using it just now. Just so you know, there's also another firmware update if you have a DVT unit. So worth looking out for that as an aside. Uh, hopefully that's been of use to you. I know it's unfortunate there's no easy way to reset your PIN number and keep everything that you had in the device. But really the Absolute is quite a simple device. It doesn't take long to set up. I've already published a video on that, on how to set up your your device for the first time and it's worth watching i'll link a card at the top of the description and uh, thanks for watching i'll catch you in the next video bye for now